morning, everybody. Uh, so Consensus uh, is a growing formation approaching 900 technologists and entrepreneurs in over 30 countries. Um, we are dedicated to the growth and adoption of the blockchain uh, and decentralization ecosystems. Uh, Consensus Labs, our venture studio, now has over 50 separate product teams, uh, we call them spokes, uh, working to build open protocol-based platforms and applications, services, core components, developer tools, and infrastructure. Uh, our deep infrastructure handles on average 6.5 billion queries per day uh, from the public Ethereum ecosystem. Uh, that's 2x the number of uh, requests that Google handles per day. Truffle, our developer tool suite, uh, now has over half a million downloads supporting an Ethereum developer base estimated uh, by Gartner's former lead blockchain analyst at 40 times the next largest blockchain community. Consensus is also an enterprise and government consultancy uh, partnering with many of you around the world in areas such as energy, banking, insurance, supply chain, education, and healthcare. On the government side, uh, some of our clients include Smart Dubai, the Monetary Authority of Singapore, and other central banks, the European Union Blockchain Observatory, uh, and in Zug in Switzerland, our Uport Identity System uh, is about to be used by citizens to access government services and soon to vote in plebiscites. Consensus is a founding member of the Enterprise Ethereum Alliance, a rapidly growing community of over 500 organizations across major industries focused on enterprise-specific requirements, specifications, and use cases. Some time ago, we started building a team with deep cloud experience. That team has been steadily growing and has trained its sites with laser focus on bringing the Ethereum technology to enterprise. Today, Consensus has a very special announcement uh, that marks another pivotal moment for, enterprise, for the enterprise blockchain community. Uh, this will transform how we all build economic, social, and political systems together. I've had the opportunity to come to this conference for several years now, and it's been really interesting each year as it's grown. Looking out at you this morning, you all look great, by the way. Um, you know, I think the thing about these blockchain conferences is the energy that you can feel. And it's, it's, I think it's useful to remember that we are all here because we do believe in the promise of blockchain. But if that's true, I've got a question for you this morning. Why are we not seeing greater, faster enterprise adoption? Here's what the data says. Gartner just published a study, over 3,000 CIOs, reporting in that just 1% of them have any kind of real adoption within their organization of blockchain. Why is that? Well, we have a little secret, don't we? Blockchain is hard. And getting a group of organizations, forming a consortium, getting that consortium online on a blockchain is really hard. Let's briefly look at three reasons why, and then let's talk about how we can go farther and faster together. Imagine you set out on a POC, you've got an innovative idea that could be powered by blockchain. So you want to test out your use case. You look around, you come across what's be, um, referred to as a blockchain as a service. It has scripts and templates, it helps you stand up a sandbox. But that only gets you so far. Because this is all so new, it's moving so fast, 
you've got many unanswered questions. You've just hit the first major challenge, the technology learning curve. We're familiar with this one, right? Distributed networks, smart contracts, consensus, new programming languages, new frameworks, heavy cryptography, on and on. After lots of experimenting, let's assume you get over that hurdle and you move on. The business leaders love the prototype and the race is on to pilot. Real, real transactions, real data on a limited scale. Well, you soon realize that this shared network is like, unlike any of your existing systems. Because of their shared ownership, there also must be shared administration of the network. And what's more, no one's in complete control. Think about it. All parties agreeing to live by a single copy of the business logic with a single record of the transactions, you've now discovered the next major challenge. We call it shared IT. Think about something as simple as deploying a new version of a smart contract. You know how to do change management within your own enterprise, but how do you do that across the distributed network? What sort of things do you need? You need policies, you need checkpoints, workflow, voting, governance, ideally automatically enacted and enforced on the blockchain itself. You need shared IT. Well, by now you're probably months behind schedule. You spent a lot of time cobbling together missing tools and workflows. And while many projects are stalling, as we saw earlier, let's say you're lucky and get the green light to go to production. Now your third and hardest challenge, to marry these new technologies and processes with your legacy backend systems. Run it all securely, reliably, and at scale. Requires a hardening and scaling learning curve. How do you go from five organizations to 50 or 500 where the economic payoff for the project was in the first place? How do you ensure enterprise grade characteristics, all compliant with your industry regulations? One day you wake up and realize that four week POC has turned into a multi-year, multi-million dollar project. And those thousands of lines of custom code that you wrote along the way are already obsolete because the tech is evolving so quickly underneath you. And that was the happy path. No wonder so many projects are struggling. At Consensus, we are challenging that this is as good as it gets. We believe in blockchain's promise. However, we recognize that society won't truly benefit until enterprises get to real adoption. So let's look at how we do that. Well, we need to radically simplify the entire journey, all three challenges solved in a single solution. We need a new generation of blockchain service, way beyond the scripts and templates of today. It's interesting to note that if you look across IT, we do have models. We know how to solve these problems. For example, look at what Salesforce did for CRMs. We need to bring that level of simplicity to blockchain. Proven deployments, less risk, increased velocity, dramatically lower total costs of ownership. In short, we need to bring a new economic equation to your blockchain projects. Introducing Kaleido, the blockchain business cloud, an all-in-one platform for creation and operation of private chains, made radically simple with enterprise in its DNA. For the first time, the enterprise community can adopt blockchain through a simple SaaS model. What Salesforce did for CRMs, Kaleido is doing for blockchain. We built it from scratch, focusing on the enduring problems in this space to take you all the way from concept to consortium. Let me show you a bit of Kaleido in action. We can see how standing up a network can occur in just a few seconds. With Kaleido, business networks are called consortiums, and a consortium is defined by its charter. 
Standing up environments is incredibly streamlined. In an industry first, Kaleido makes protocol consensus algorithm choice, click button simple on a single screen. Environments come up almost instantly and are deployed according to a hardened configuration. There are also a number of additional integrated tools and services, such as a private ether pool available for projects that are focusing on token economy use cases, a system monitor tracking the health status of the network and nodes in real time, our ledger API providing access to activity and statistics pre-indexed in the side store for efficient analytics, and scope our blockchain explorer, offering a deeper level of insight than others available today. It gives the ability to view and search live historical details, including blocks, transactions, contracts, even including Quorum's private transactions. And transactions are linked to smart contracts. Scope can even verify contract authenticity. What's more, Kaleido is built with shared IT at its core. The member onboarding challenge is tackled in just a few simple steps. Adding new members is streamlined through an email invitation process. Organizations own and operate their own nodes to ensure the diversity and integrity of consensus. And organizations collectively control changes to the network according to multi-party policy. Integrating with existing systems is a classic challenge. And on your own, it can be, become a costly and complex afterthought. So we've built Kaleido Connect to help address the integration challenge right out of the box. From securing network connections, to plugging in existing monitoring and DevOps, to hydrating a data lake, to securing the application layer. It's easier to integrate your blockchain on Kaleido. This is a blockchain business cloud. So enterprise is in its DNA. In our tenancy model, all networks are completely isolated, and ingress to nodes within a network is unique and isolated per member. Storage is encrypted and dedicated. Networks are automatically distributed across availability zones in a region. We've built for elastic scale, resiliency, hardened security, optimized performance. Running your network on Kaleido means the whole group operates at the same stringent levels of security and robustness, so there is no weak link. Now, this one's really exciting and significant. Public and private blockchains have been evolving largely independently over the last couple years. We knew a next-generation platform must focus on convergence between the two. That's why Kaleido's the first platform that gives you the option to anchor your private chain to the main net and indelibly store your hash state on the public blockchain. And with Kaleido Century, we're working to complete the feedback loop and put policy in your hands to detect and act on anomalous behavior within your private network. True to our mission, we've also made turning on main net tethering click button simple. With this feature, you can enhance the trustworthiness of your private chain by augmenting it with an irrefutable audit trail out on the public blockchain. We're very excited to see what you do with this innovative feature. I'm also happy to say that Kaleido is already live. We've quietly been running this platform for months with early customers running on it. And we're already seeing its impact in helping consortiums move with greater speed and efficiency. One powerful example we're pleased to showcase for the very first time is called Project Eye to Eye. To tell you more, please welcome Justo Ortiz, Chairman of the Board of Union Bank. This uh, partnership uh, between Union Bank and between Consensus and Cantilan Bank, what we're all trying to solve is financial inclusion. So the question is, how do we get financially excluded Filipinos who are generally located in the rural countryside of the Philippines? Now the rural banks can be connected one to the other to 
basically support each other in creating this national franchise. So good morning, ladies and gentlemen. You saw a really quick video, which was a very quick introduction to Project Eye to Eye. So it's a partnership among Union Bank of the Philippines, Consensus, Kaleido, and five pilot rural banks. Let me make the case. I am one of 105 million Filipinos. Lovely people, full of hope, always with a ready smile. But 35 million Filipinos live on less than $2 a day. And 35 million adult Filipinos are unbanked. So this is clearly a huge opportunity for financial inclusion, a chance to make a difference in a very meaningful way. If only we simply onboard these 35 million Filipinos into the financial ecosystem, especially to arbitrage usurious village moneylenders uh, through credit intervention affordably. And if you frame this with the predictions that many experts make, that the Philippines will be a G20 country by 2050. This also represents a huge opportunity to be at the ground floor of an emerging middle market. We believe that the rural banks are best suited to bank these 35 million unbanked Filipinos. But here's the thing, the rural banks are themselves financially excluded. They are unbanked themselves. They are not connected at all to the domestic money payment system and definitely not to the international payment system. And this is quite unfortunate because as you know, the Philippines has a huge workforce, about 10 million families depend on their livelihood from a family member abroad that remits money into the Philippines, which currently costs a lot relative to the meager amounts that are remitted because of the uncompetitive and alternative uh, channels that need to be used. So what's our strategy? Our strategy is to connect each rural bank one to the other so that as a collective, they can form their own national payment system. And from here, we can then connect to the international payment system. And I think this is a very important step. Our solution is project eye to eye. So we are onboarding this um, untrusting actors, the rural bank, onto the blockchain. As, 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 as was mentioned, we're partnering Union Bank with Consensus, running on the Kaleido platform. But we're not making an off-the-shelf solution. We are working with the rural banks. So this is a story of collaboration and of co-creation. So we're building a decentralized, near real-time, cost-effective, secure retail payment system on the blockchain. But we also are reducing the cost of transactions because what we noticed is that we can eliminate more than 20 transaction steps 
in the fulfillment of an international remittance transaction compared to how it is currently done. But the most important part is that it inserts the rural bank into the cash flows of their customers in the communities, and this gives them the data points to be able to do a proper risk assessment, to be able to give affordable credit, to engage their customers in a localized, relevant way, and most importantly, to be a catalyst to inclusive prosperity. So on May 22, at the National Convention of the Rural Banks in Davao, Philippines, we're going to launch this project. And we are really excited to see the fruits of this endeavor because it truly has the potential to elevate lives and to fulfill dreams of 35 million unbanked Filipinos. And we are looking forward to this continuing partnership with Consensus and Kaleido and the rural banks to make this a reality going forward. Thank you. All right, pretty cool. Chairman of the board of a bank who's dressed more casually than I am. It's pretty cool. I've got one more surprise for you. You might be wondering where Kaleido runs. We needed a partner that is a proven leader with global reach, scale, production quality in its DNA as well. We're very excited to announce that Kaleido is available in partnership between Consensus and AWS. Please join me in welcoming Josh Hoffman, GM Global Lead of AWS Partner Ecosystem onto the stage. Welcome, Josh. Thanks, Steve. We're, uh, we're pretty excited to be here. I think it's a pivotal day today for the enterprise blockchain community. Let's start with understanding a little bit about AWS's approach to the enterprise blockchain market. Yeah, so uh, our partner approach is really our approach to blockchain. What I mean by that is our customers want to maximize choice and they want to maximize experimentation. And the way that we do that is to make sure that it's as easy as possible for enterprise customers to test and use a variety of different blockchain solutions. Um, it's why we've partnered with consensus across a number of different industries where we're seeing some really interesting projects uh, in areas like financial services, in public sector, in healthcare, and in travel, where we're seeing new projects with IP rights, land registries, self-sovereign genomics, and a variety of other different uh, projects in those industries. And we also see the project work with eye to eye at Union Bank and Catalan Bank uh, is giving the ability to disrupt and giving our customers the ability to make it easy to create new markets for themselves. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Could you talk a little bit more about the partnership between AWS and Consensus? Sure. Uh, so we look at our partnerships across two different dimensions. Uh, the first is customer success, and so we want to make sure that we've got demonstrated customer success so that our customers know that there are working uh, customers behind that. And the second thing is technical proficiency. So we do things like well-architected reviews and a number of other things to make sure that the architectures are, are pretty solid. So based on the merit of those two things, we're proud to announce that uh, Consensus is the first pure play blockchain software uh, provider to be uh, advanced tier status in the Amazon Partner Network. So it's awesome. Yeah, very exciting. And then how does Kaleido fit in? And what do you see the benefit being for AWS's customers? Well, I mean, in, in addition to all the first that you talked about a little bit earlier, the, the thing with Kaleido is, is it creates a very easy way for customers to try blockchain. Uh, and it creates a very easy way so that they don't necessarily have to bring together all the building blocks. It's also the first solution that's available uh, as a SaaS hosted environment for blockchain on the AWS marketplace. So for everybody in here, 
you have the ability right now to go to the AWS Marketplace uh, and launch Kaleido. So hopefully everybody has an AWS account. Uh, and if you do, then this is something that you could do right now. So we see it as a very innovative solution to make it really easy for our customers uh, to deploy enterprise blockchain projects. So we're really, really excited to see what the community does with it. All right. Thank you, Josh. Thanks, Steve. Look forward Thank to you. a continued partnership going forward. So I know I covered a lot of ground, exciting news today. Let me just wrap up and reiterate, Kaleido is available now. Check us out on Kaleido.io. Find us in the AWS Marketplace. Give Kaleido a try for free. You can also find us at the Consensus booth. Meet our experts. Give us some feedback. That's all the time I've got. Let's go farther and faster together. Thank you.